today let's start from this neck area are you ready Good morning and good afternoon and good evening. Hello, face yogis. How are you? So the pose we are going to do, I think some of you know already or many of you know already, but if you don't, this is a good pose. And even you know this pose already, I want you to really visualize that sternocleidal muscle, the big muscle right here to right here, the center of your collarbone, right here, a sternum, okay? and then platysma, the big muscle right here. Okay, and a good posture. So I'm gonna show from this, uh, this view so that you can see a little bit more. Interlace your fingers in front of you, okay? And uh, push your hands away. Whoa, when you push your hands away from you, do you feel a nice stretch in the back of the body right here? a shoulder right here do you feel that okay do you feel that whoa i feel it and now i want you to kind of explore a little bit more everybody's different so it means i want you to push hands away and then go back and forth so like whoa 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 up and down do you feel that that that's place you feel the most nice stretch on the back that's where you want to keep that Okay, you keep that and a breathe in and out and nice posture. Your head is resting on top of your spine and a breathe in and out. Imagine platysma and then move your head 45 degree angle, a chin up slightly. You feel that? And then your hand goes to other side. Ooh, I feel more sensation. Ooh, I feel it. Pack your mouth a little bit more. And if you're willing to, you can even move your gaze toward the ceiling and see how much sensation you can feel by doing this pose. And hold this for 10 seconds. Okay, we are going to do the other side and then let's switch the position. So if you interlace your fingers this way, let's switch to this. Okay, right here. And the same thing, push your hands away from you and then feel a nice sensation right here. Woo, I feel it, I feel it. Do you feel that? The tightness and then push your hands away and shoulder blades down. This is important, okay? Don't tighten your shoulder. Push down and push your hands away from you, good. So you find the spot like, whoa, this is a spot. And now we are going to go other direction, right? So. Move your chin slightly, ooh, 45 degree angle, and then hands to the other side. And keep your shoulders down and pack out your mouth. And if you're willing to explore a little bit more, move your gaze toward the ceiling and open your eyes as wide, but don't wrinkle your forehead, relax. And then one of the face yoga method of poses, chest opener. We are going to do it together. When we do this one, make sure your elbow is going in center, not inside. See, when I do the side, can you see that? This gets more obvious, right? When I move this one, see that? It's off. My necklace goes off too. You want to have it center line. And when we do the chest opener, make sure this one goes all the way up. And also your shoulders are going the same way. Not one side is higher. Nope, same way. And we breathe in. And when we breathe out, that's when we push on the shoulder blades. Same speed. One more breathe in. And a breathe out. Okay? And I keep the nice posture. And see how much you can relax your neck. And I keep this posture. And that is something, it'll, you know, it'll help you um, to keep your neck area more relaxed, but also more straight. And go to our shop and you can see what you can, you know, what you can do. But also I think jump, neck and jawline jump start might be good if you are really interested in getting the result on the neck and the jawline. I will see you very soon. Have a great rest of the day or weekend. Bye.